Hi, my name's Ian Bridgestock. I'm from Geek Designs and I'm the sales and marketing manager at the company. Uh, Geek Designs is a web design company. Uh, we're based in Peterborough. Um, we really look after small to medium sized businesses and really for new startups as well, we've just come on to with a, a, with a government scheme with Office Essentials where we try to uh, to get new businesses up online and give them a web presence because we realise how important that is at the moment. Um, it's more the fact that at the moment there is, for just in the Peterborough area, that there is there is a lack of talent around uh, for, for looking for full time and we've had a look for some time. Um, so we thought we'd go down the apprenticeship route because they're young and hungry and they want their willingness to get into work, which they struggle to at the moment because they've had, they haven't had any experience. So, you know, 3A approached us, they said what they do within the academy and they showed us what they teach them within the academy. So think, yeah, we'll give it a go, we'll see what happens, you know, what's the worst can happen and it's it turned out really well for us. Um, they approached us about having an apprentice on. We had been looking around for apprenticeships. We'd been approached by some of the colleges and that, but there was a, a lack of willingness or it was just hand out anybody to us as such. But um, Luke at 3A gave us some C3s. He vetted them all for us before putting them in front of us, which was really good. And luckily we found Adam. He has a lot of talent, um, which a lot of young people do uh, this day and age. And it's really, it's to find and to develop that as well, and he, and he will become a good designer. Oh, he's, he's learned to it. It's more down to the design. It's all about having the eye for design, which he has and which he can develop, but it's more down to the, the web base that he's had of lack of in. So at the moment, uh, Alex, a member of our team, he's been teaching him what sort of systems we use on how to use them, and uh, just the general, how to, the look of a website. I think having an apprentice within the company, starting from the bottom, because they they learn your way, the way you work, where sometimes when you bring somebody into a company, uh, it's hard to change the way they've been working to the way your systems work and what you believe in. Now, yes, we listen to some ideas, and even Adam's come up with some great ideas, which we've been blinkered to. Um, so yeah, I think definitely taking on an apprentice was the right, was the right thing to do. Well, at the moment, we'd, uh, we're taking it steady as in growth because we've seen a lot of, uh, of companies where they've got too big for themselves and they're, and they're sort of gone bust as such. But we've been going for some time now and uh, we can see ourselves uh, growing to a, to a considerable size. So I think in about five years' time, hopefully have another 10 to 15 designers working for us. It's worked for us. Um, we've had some horror stories out from where colleges have tried to offer out apprenticeships. It's more getting out numbers, but I think with the three, three AA, they've they've worked well. They they vet them, and I would recommend the company to them. They're, they do pick out some good talent there, and their requirements are higher than you find with normal colleges as well. A good company at what they seem to be at the moment, and they have uh, they have produced some good uh, some good talent to put in front of me so it's a shame I couldn't take them all on.